Heyo, it's Abby, and today I have a super fun collab. I have been so excited for this video. We've been planning it for a while now, and it is happening. So, today's video is sponsored by Kika Goods. You all know that they are super good to me. They let me open a bunch of different blind boxes to introduce to you guys and to add to my collection. And on top of that, they have been super sweet and helped coordinate this collab with Mevu. If you are a blind box or collectible lover like me, I'm sure that you already follow Mevu. If not, you need to go over and check out her channel and her video because we sent each other blind boxes from Kika Goods. We picked out blind boxes for each other from the Kika Goods website. We had some themes that we followed, so we'll be checking those out. But before that, here are five blind boxes from Kika Goods that we are both checking out and we are going to compare and see what we got. So after you watch my video, make sure to go check out Mevu's video. But yeah, we both should be opening these five and I'm excited. I haven't seen this Malinta yet and this one looks really fun. The first one is the Ohu, 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 I guess, Rabbit Strawberry Mousse Tea. I love this packaging. Look how pastel and cute it is. It looks like a little cake. And obviously the theme is strawberry mousse tea. I think that's the series name. And this is a plushy blind box. We've been seeing more of these lately and I am loving them. So the brand is strawberry mousse ta, it says here. Mousseta, it's not mousse tea, excuse me. And the product name is a whole rabbit series. It looks like this is just glued down. So let's open it up. And there's a blind bag inside. A quick glance at the lineup. There's five designs, one hidden. I want that purple one or the pink one. I think those would be cute. Oh, not so I don't want to tear. How about this side? There we go. Ooh, I see white. Oh, it's super soft. Ja -ja. Oh my goodness, it's a little bunny. Oh my goodness, there's wings on the back. A little tail. And then I think, yeah. Oh, did not expect that. I was gonna say, I think it's a reel, but it is a... <laughs> it shakes. It comes with a custom strap, it says strawberry musetta, musetta. Is that like a mousse? So you can hold it or strap it onto something. I imagine this unsnaps. I don't wanna break it though, so maybe not because it does come with a lobster clasp too. Oh, and then it has a little rubber charm of the bunny. How cute is that? It's so soft too. I have to make sure I keep her clean though. It kind of reminds me of a little tooth. I love it. So there's a card in the package, in the box here. This one is manager. Oh, look at this is so cute. There's sweets on the back, Ohu Rabbit. And there's little ears on top too. I love this card. So we have manager. Let's check out this little capybara next. There are six designs, five secrets. That's a lot of secrets. Um, What was this one called? It was capybara bean something, I think. I thought it was gonna be um, like beans, but I think it's just called that. They're not tiny necessarily. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is this one where they're like pulling a tub of capybaras? I'd like that one, please. And then I guess the secret ones are iridescent. I think that's that one. They might be recolors. Unsure, so let's dive in. Oh, this flap is cute. It's die cut. There we go. Oh, it comes in a foam, styrofoam holder. Okay, who is this? Oh, spoiler. Oh, it's another one of the, I swear these are ceramic. I don't think they're plastic. Maybe they are. Oh no, it's made with resin. Okay, so it's not ceramic. It is plastic, but I don't know why it's so heavy. We have Capybara mom trying to feed their child a carrot and looks like Capybara baby does not want to eat a carrot maybe. It kind of looks like baby's being held hostage. I can't read all those characters. Maybe someone can explain to me what's going on. The art's adorable. 
Someday I'm gonna go see them in the hot springs. I live in Japan, so I feel like I should. Next, why don't we check out Bread Puppy. This looks really cute and they look really glossy on the art, so I'm hoping they are. The hot dog, I love that. The little corgi and burger, I think those are my favorite. Also the Shiba just stuck in the toast, kind of amazing. Let's open it up. Oh, this is another one. I think this is a really nice way to package them though because it keeps them safe. Let's see who's in here. It looks quite orange. Oh, is it hot dog? Nope, it is just splooting corgi. I think it is just the corgi. She's splooting. Is that mustard or mayonnaise on him? Look at him. I care him. Look at the little sploot. That is precious. Okay, we'll put you up here. Where's Capybara? You can sit up here too. Next, let's check out Yumo, Natural Journey. Um, it's my first time checking out Yumo. It's by Joe Toys. Look at, there's some really cute designs in here. I want, oh, there's one with a bird on their head. A seal? A little ghost? That kind of looks like a jellyfish. A bat or devil, bunny. Wind? Fire? Sheep? Angel? It's like elements and animals. Like I think that one's a moth. I'm very curious about this one. Let's pull this tab. Oh, which one do I want? I'm kind of curious about the bird one. I think that could be really cute. Oh, there's a card in there. Let's not peek. Oh, I think we got it. Manifested. It's like a little strawberry bird. And then Yumo has wings. Super cute, super soft, like a little baby. Obviously the color on the box is just from the art. So I thought it was gonna be a little more brighter, but it's a very soft, kind of peachy color. Very pastel. We like Yumo. Also look at that beak. Yeah, I think it's a little bird. Doesn't really say what kind, or maybe it does and I just can't read it. But I love the little animal hat. It's too good. Last one from these five. I wonder which ones Mavu's getting. This is the Molinta City Wandering series. And I want the one with the purple dress. There's five secrets. I assume, hmm, small hiddens? This one just says secret. That one's 0.8%. These are 2.3% and the others are 10%. So this might be one of the sets where they do alternate figures. They've been doing that lately, I feel like. We want purple dress. Oh, I forgot the card's connected. There we go, I peeled it off without looking. Look at this bag, it's so cute. There's the baguettes. A succulent, a little umbrella, a cup of coffee. Oh, it's not purple, but she does have a cup of coffee. There's something else in here too. Oh, glasses, oh my goodness. I feel like these are supposed to go on her head and not her face. <laughs> They're a bit oversized for her face. Let's see if we can just get them to go on her head. Ah! They don't want to stay. Ah! Never mind, they just fell on the floor. <laughs> I'll figure them out later. They kind of didn't want to sit on her head. So we have Molinta with a book bag, her tote bag, cup of coffee, and wearing a nice casual outfit, some white flats, very casual. Looks like she's maybe on lunch break. Maybe she's just on her day off, who knows? This one is called Slow Life Enjoyment. It does kind of seem like a day off kind of vibe. There is the card, adorable. We love Popcorn Sister. I'm excited to see Mavu's video and see which one she got. I wonder if we got any doubles. That would be funny if we did. Next, we have the five blind boxes that we picked out for each other. We had three themes we could pick from and then we had to get five blind boxes for each other. So we did pastel, animals, and minifigures. 
Obviously Maeve found a loophole for me and I think these are maybe one listing. I'm not sure, we'll have to check out the website. But we have six of these Miko Cheers and we love Miko, it's a Japanese artist. And you may be thinking, well, in that case, then there's only four there. I kind of opened one on stream last week. I got confused and didn't realize that Zoton was one that Meivu had picked for me, so she has been unboxed, but she belongs in the pastel category, I believe. We love her. We already talked about this on stream, but the new Zotons are so good. Very, very nice quality. Anyway, we are going to dive in. If you want to see what I picked out for Meivu, go check out her video after I finish unboxing. And where do we start? You know what? I kind of want to start with the Taiyaki. Isn't this packaging amazing? So it is a Taiyaki blind box and this is by Planet Bear. And I actually saw their booth at Design Festa a few weeks ago and it's so cute. Adorable. Amazing. I love it. So it's actually my first time opening one of their Taiyakis. I'm not sure how to open this. Do we take a bite from it? Do we rip its head open? If any of you know how to open this, let me know because I'm probably doing it wrong. Oh no, there we go. Oh, I see, I see a prop of some sort here. What is that? Is that like a burnt chef's hat? Here is the blind bag. There's a card. Let's not look at that. A story of Pan Pan Town. Ooh, I love the paper bag. That's nice. Oh, it is. Here we have the little Taiyaki Panda. Oh my goodness. Cooking maybe fried rice. Oh, the shading on this is amazing. I love it. A little apron. Hold on, let me get his hat out. Oh my goodness. What a distinguished chef. Look at that hat, so tall. Oh, look at the Taiyaki has a face. That's amazing, I love this so much. These are adorable. Good choice, Mavu. Little chef making fried rice. The only thing about this packaging is we can't see the lineup, but I know that there are so many cuties in this set. Since we opened one animal blind box, why don't we go ahead and open another? This is Lulu Rainbow Sheep. Look how cute they are! Look at that rainbow! I believe these are plushies as well. I want the purple one or the secret rainbow one. Oh, and they all have different meanings. Infinity white, happiness yellow, reconcile green, faith blue, caring purple, love pink. And then happy ever after rainbow. I want caring purple. This packaging is so cute too. kind of want to keep the box and use it for like a journal cover. Oh, well, the bag's purple, if that means anything. I could be totally wrong, though. Oh, yep, there we go. Stop. Look at this little cutie. Look at the little Lulu on the tag. Yeah, Lulu is another IP that is growing on me. We got the Pig Shillin blind box a few months ago, and then I opened a travel series one recently. Too cute. We love Lulu. So round and so soft. Will you sit up? Oh, you will. Okay. Look at this little Lulu shaped card. Love pink. This art style is so pretty. Very watercolor, soft touch. I think we saved the beans for last. Let's open this Tinar figure. It is the Sakura Campus series. I love these. Look at them. Pastel, dreamy, cute. They're amazing. So I actually have the tennis one. I really want her because she has Abby colored hair, even though it's upside down. I love the little band girl. I think it's this one. I think they're all doing like different school club activities. Let's see who we get. Oh, I see blonde hair. You think that's Guitar Girl? No, it's not. Oh, ah, who is she? Oh, I saw the little part. I think I know who she is. 
I guess the owl is kind of a hint. She's wise. Look at that outfit though. So cute. Let's get that dust off of your face. A little mint pleated skirt, sweater, long hair. Love the shoes. Let me get her props and then you can see who she is. This gives it away. A chessboard, glasses, and a hat. She's super smart. That took a few minutes to put together. We're really struggling with the glasses today. But look at her. I would love a pink and blue chessboard. This is so cute. I love the TNR BJDs. They are so cute, but there's something about these figures. They're so good. There's so much detail in them. Another good pick. Let's put the tall ones in the middle. Last but not least, we have the little beans. We have six of these. There is one in a pack. It is Miko Cheers. And I didn't realize this, but these are mini sew blind boxes, so that's really cool. Does it say how many designs there are? Just says one pack. Let's open it up and see. Oh, oh, they're bigger than I thought. Okay, here is our first one. Who is this? You know what? She reminds me of Gabby from Toy Story 4. I think it's the pigtails. These are not feet coming out of her face, even though it looks like it from below. I think they perch. Super cute. Let's open them all and see if we have a good variety. Number two. I hope we get the cute animal friends. Oh. Oh, I think this is a puppy. A little cutie pie with little kiwi accessories. Look at that face. Number three. Oh, this is so much fun. We get to open a bunch of little ones. Another spectacular choice. Oh, we have another little girl. Very cute. I love the eyes. We need the little kitty. I think that's the main character. Also, how many? Oh, it says the names of the designs on the back. Miko, Mousse, Latte, Creamy, Souffle, and then Miko, Miko. Like alternatives, maybe? Oh, is this a set of six, maybe? It can't be. Can it? Oh. Doubles, but not doubles. It's like an alternate. Oh, you know what? This one's matte, and this one's a little more glossy. Ah! Dropping everything. She's way across the room. I'll pick her up at the end, because I'm kind of wedged in between my camera and my desk right now. That is an issue. Oh, another puppy friend. Oh, this one's so cute. You know, this style really reminds me of Swimmer, the brand. Adorable. I love the yellow bow. I don't know who's who though. Okay, so this one, we're still missing that one. We don't have that one either. We don't have Miko. Oh, we don't have any of the drinks. Wait. Oh, I'm dumb. There's more in here. They all come with drinks. Crap, I don't know who belongs to who. Whoopsie, two purples. We might have to look at the website. Oh my goodness, I'm glad I noticed. Okay, this is unopened. Here's another purple drink. I totally would have missed that. They're right there in the photo. How did I miss that? I'm glad we found them. So one, two, three, four, five. This is six. Another blonde girl with strawberry accessories this time and different eyes. Purple drink again. So let me go pick up the one that I dropped and I'll open up the drinks and we'll take a closer look at them. I got them all lined up. Looks like we're missing the yellow drink and it looks like on the box that maybe there are two shades of pink. On the box it says, the picture is for reference only. Take the real product as standard. So the art on the box could be totally different. But here are the six that I got. They are adorable. I love these. They come with little drinks, which I'm glad we found. Super good choice for minifigures. And here are the other figures I got today. Kika Good sent us some good boxes to open. I'm running over to Maeve's video after this to see which ones she got. Let's go check them out together. If you enjoyed this video, you can purchase all of these figures on Kika Goods. You can use my code Lorian for 10% off. 
product. And that is just a coupon code for you guys, but it does let Kika Goods know that you enjoyed my video and hopefully they'll want to collaborate with me more in the future. This was such a super fun video. Please let me know if you enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below and I will see you all next time. Bye!